you get it all drilled out, you got little anchors. To put these anchors in, you shove the anchors in the hole, push those in. And these will work in drywall or siding or concrete, whichever way you want. Okay, then come back to your box, unscrew your lid, which you can already have it done before you get ready to do this. On your box, there's only four screws on it. The rest of the screws are in the packet. It's real simple to do. Now, your box lid is unplugged. These wires will be plugging in in a little bit. Put your screws in. We, we didn't check to make sure it'll fit through the hole. We didn't check to make sure it was okay. I'll be quiet. <laughs> All right, we'll get it here in just a second here. Then you take your box and you've got the holes in the back that will pull down. Then you screw it the rest of the way on. I use this kind of screwdriver, it's a lot easier. It makes it a lot more simpler trying to show everybody how to do it. Now, you have a third screw. If you think you need it, you can put it in one of the other holes. But in this here application, you only need one. And you wanna make sure you got it good and tight. Right there. Now see that's still a little loose. There, that's good and tight. And like I said, if you want to put another screw down here, you you can. You got an extra screw in here for that if you want. Once this is up, you've got two wires sticking out here, which is a red and a blue. And then these other wires go on your battery. I will show you how to do that in just a minute. Put your battery in, take the black to the black, and the red to the red. Like this, right there. You slide the battery in, then you get your lid. Okay. You take your lid and you plug your blue on the blue and there's little bumps on top of them for they only go on the right way and then the red on the red and then this little wire is your antenna make sure that wire is stuck inside where it don't get caught in the edge then you screw it all back together I'm only going to put four screws in it to show you what it's going to look like. And then just tighten them all down. And then you got four more to put in after you get these on. You get your remote once you get it up and Hit your remote, just make sure everything's working. Here, you hit this button, you warn your neighbors, one of your neighbors around will see this and come and check on you. Thanks again for buying Fall Alert Beacon.